Hi, Sugsters. No, that doesn't suit me. I'm in proud brother mode right now. My sister, Zoe, she uh, has gone and done makeup, hasn't she? She's brought out this, which is makeup. Look, focus. Get on that. Hello, get a load of that. See it? It's like a, a 70s style um, pressed powder palette. You've got your group hug. I don't know what that is. Oh, is that a little sticker pack? And there's stickers. Get in. I can put that on my um, table football table. Well done, Zoe. You've done absolutely amazing. I went to the launch as well for it, and it was it was so good. She, she knows how to put on an event, doesn't she? She's bringing out a book all about like how to put on good events. Oh, wait. I was thinking this would be a great gift from a girlfriend, but then I had another idea. Why don't I try and apply this to my face um, and give it a bit of a review uh, and let you guys know what I think of it and see if I can actually do my own makeup. It's been a while since I last wore... Actually, no, it hasn't. I've been wearing makeup for the last six months of my life. Oh, that was a lot easier than I thought it would be. Oh, when you smell that, it smells like when you get an, uh, when you're a kid and you get an old paddling pool. Like you get one of these little like little paddling pools out and you smell it when you fill it up with water. That kind of like nice plastic smell. I wasn't around in the 70s, but I can imagine this is what how things were carried around in the 70s. Inside the box we have a pack of stickers, a pressed powder palette with all different flavors or colors, champagne toast, pancake please. French toast, skinny latte, cinnamon sugar. Wait, are these scratch and sniff? No. Ah, oh, it smells like Pokemon card. I haven't even tried any of this yet, but already just the smell of it is getting a 9 out of 10 from me. It's making me feel nostalgic. I've already smelled old paddling pool and Pokemon cards. A lip bundle, which has already been opened. Thanks, Diane. Little one ultra matte lip and lippy pencil. Another lip bundle. Go on, get him with extra lip bundles. Uh, and we've got another lip bundle. Uh, we've got a swipe right highlighter. I just realized, well, I haven't got any brushes. I haven't got makeup brushes. Right, well, I hope you enjoyed today's video because I don't have any makeup brushes. Supernova shadow bundle. So that's eyeshadow, I think. We've got a pressed powder cheek right there. Bosch and some cream gel liners. I'm gonna go now try and find some uh, either paint brushes or see if there's anything I can steal from Diane's makeup bag. And I'll be right back. I've had an absolute touch. Found a packet of brushes. And they're not paint brushes, they're actual makeup brushes. Um, Diane, I don't know if these are important to you or you're saving them or they're really expensive and shouldn't be used for whatever this is about to be. Uh, I apologize in the future and um, send me the invoice afterwards and I'll, I'll refund you, I'm sorry. Right, starting off, how did, where do you start? Lips, eyes, and not too sure. Might have to Google. We're gonna start off with the pressed powder cheek. I feel like a lot of you right now are gonna be screaming at me like, Joe, what are you doing? This is completely wrong. But don't worry, Sugsters, because I've got it all under control. Reminds me of a Polly Pocket. Opening up, I mean, not that I had Polly Pockets growing up. I had Mighty Max, obviously. But it reminds me of Zoe's Polly Pockets that she used to have. It's pink. Um, so I guess that's that's the colour we're going for on the old cheeks. Little rosy cheeks. I'm going to go red first and then this one on top. I don't know what I'm doing, but I hope I'm doing it right. So get some of this on the brush, like so. This is the... Uh, Sug technique of swiping from the right to the left. I don't know what I'm doing. I need to look in the mirror. It's looking good. Okay, boom, bosh. When I was younger, I was actually very good at art. I used to love it. It was one of my favorite subjects at school. And so like painting and stuff to me comes really natural. So I think if I really tried and did it on other people, I think I'd actually be quite good at makeup. Like Mario, what's his chops? It does the Kardashians. If I wanted to transfer her into the, into the, uh, Makeup world. I reckon I could actually make waves. I reckon I could do do some pretty cool stuff. So I've put on the red, but you've got to do this. You get those contours. Now I'm going to get the highlighter once again. Don't know if this is right, but hey ho. And I'm going to highlight my cheekbones because that's what I've heard on a makeup video before. You've got to highlight the cheekbones. You suck in like this. And you contour. Oh, this is made to go like proper shiny. So I've got fish scales on my face. Contour my nose. Do you know what? I've always been a big fan of my nose. Just gonna put it out there. Self-love and all that. It's got a light bulb on the end of my nose. Love that. Next thing we're gonna move on to. I just need to figure out what a palette's for. I feel like palette is something to do with eyes. I honestly feel like Charlie Wonka ever it? No, what was Charlie Wonka? Charlie Wonka. <laughs> Charlie Bucket when he opens the, the golden ticket. Oh, do you know what? I'm actually impressed with this. Oh! And he's changing my pants. Adorable little palette right here. I'm liking the look. I want to get something quite bold. Maybe blue brunch club. I love that color. 
<laughs> Listen to what I'm saying. Skinny latte, cinnamon sugar, or Sunday fun day are standing out to me. Can you mix stuff on a palette? Is that, that's why it's called a palette, I guess. You can mix the colours together, like an art palette. I bet these are like really rare brushes that you can't even get in the UK, and then I'm in trouble. These are handcrafted in the bush, Jar. You can't get these anywhere else but Australia. <laughs> We're gonna be out there, guys. We're gonna give some cinnamon sugar, baby. Bosh, see that? And just pop it on your eyelid. Always the top of your eyelid, not the bottom. Do you know what? And I'm gonna put this out there, everyone. I think I've absolutely aced that. Look at that. That is decent. I've genuinely smashed it. I've seen girls with worse eyeshadow than that. My left eyelid's not relaxing. It looks like a crinkled testicle at the moment. Just relax, Joe. Don't worry. Nothing can go wrong. Oh, no. This is bad. This is so much harder left-handed. It tickles my eyeball underneath the skin. Is that normal? Oh. Well, this is one way to test out if this new makeup stains your clothes. Look at that. Boom. Be very careful, because some people say in the makeup industry, mixing blue and gold is a big no-no. I live life on the edge when it comes to makeup. Yes. So now I've got the blue in there, look. Look at that. Check that out. That's actually not bad. Let's open this up. So this in here, we've got... Oh. This looks liquidy. Where does this go? Shadow bundle. Wing tip. Now that just defines it a little bit. Oh no, I've leaked way too much on the side. This is what annoys me about makeup videos. You, you do so well and right at the end you can absolutely mess it up. Right, moving on. Cream gel liner. And this is where it gets crazy. We've got the liner. I could do that all day long. I'm going to draw on the bottom of my eyelid and hope for the best. I'm concentrating so hard. Oh! Oh, oh my god. That looks good. I'm enjoying this. I mean, I mean, I'm probably completely wrong, but I think it looked quite cool. Lip bundle. These little lip bundle pens and stuff and eye pens remind me so much of the little like felt tip pens we got when like when we were kids. All right. Oh yeah. I'm just going to draw in my whole lips. It feels right, you know. Oh yes. I think I fancy myself. If I was a girl, I would pick this color. Look at that. I am well chuffed. Do you know what? For for trying that out, I think this is not actually a bad a bad a bad attempt. We've got a darker red here, so I'm gonna try and go around it with a little line. A lip line, that's it, a lip line. Show me where your lip line. Waste the day and spend the night. I could have a lip line. Oh yeah. Boom. Done the lip line. <laughs> this actually looks really good. High five. I'm gonna go back to my eyes and just give it a little bit of Sunday fun day because this colour is screaming out to me from the palette. Like I said. Palettes are for experimenting. Or experimenting. I don't know why I said it like that. I've got a little bit of makeup dust on my nose, but don't worry, um, Sugsters. If that happens, you just get a damp cloth um, and start all over again. This is the finished look. Uh, I hope you enjoy it. I've probably been using the wrong brushes and using the wrong things for the wrong part of my body or face or whatever. But overall, I think it's quite good. <laughs> hey sister. Oh my god, Joe. Do you think it's good? That is awful. The lips look really scary. What do you mean? Why do you outline your lips? Because there's two different pens. I got a very confused as what does what. There's just... You outlined in red pen and then filled in pink. Yeah, I'm starting a new trend. Did you use every single colour? I tried to use every product, yeah. I wanted to show I wanted to rev like review it and show what you could get. <laughs> Doesn't help that I've got a moustache yeah. growing through. Mm. Yeah, gonna watch rugby with it on down the pub. What would you rate it out of 10? Um, I'll give you a solid 7.5. You heard it here first 7.5 from Zoe herself. I love how you've got like it's like classic boy with a makeup palette who's never used one before. I had to google what where you used the palette. I had no, I forgot, I had no idea. Anyway, I'm going to end today's video there. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Um, congrats, Zoe. I'll leave a link down below if you like the look of this. Uh, unfortunately, I don't come with the makeup. I know, annoying. I'll see you next week with another Sug Sunday special. Cheers. Goodbye. Mwah. Oh, no, I've got it in my hand.
It's so hard to get a thumbnail because look, it's so shiny. Next collection, though, don't make it shiny.